In 1977, NASA launched a pair of spacecraft known as Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, setting them on a mission unlike anything seen before in any scene. These twin marvels were crafted to explore the far reaches of our solar system, and eventually the interstellar void. They were equipped with advanced instruments that, for their time, were extremely sophisticated, enabling them to capture images from space, scenes never before witnessed by humankind. Their journey became a grand tour through the outer planets. They flew past Jupiter and Saturn, recalling breathtaking images of their atmospheric scenes and revealing secrets hidden in planetary storms, massive clouds, and majestic rings. These visuals changed how we understood our solar system. Both voyagers carried the golden record, a disc intended to speak for Earth across the cosmic stage. It contained music, greetings and natural sounds, painting a picture of life on our planet in the event of contact with alien life. In 1981, Voyager 2 approached Saturn. Drawing from its siblings' discoveries, it captured clearer scenes of the planet's intricate rings, which were not smooth bands but complex formations of braids, kinks, and dust particles. Later, Voyager 2 reached Uranus, a world with a spin axis tilted 98 degrees, creating a strange orbital scene. It discovered two new rings and eleven moons, giving humanity its first look at this iced planet. The probe measured temperatures of minus 353 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 213 degrees Celsius, and even crossed a plasmoid, allowing scientists to study Uranus's unique magnetic field in incredible detail. In 1990, Voyager 1 turned its camera toward Earth and took a photo that changed history, the pale blue dot, a tiny pixel suspended in the blackness of space, a powerful scene that put everything into perspective. Taken from over 4 billion miles, the photo revealed Earth's fragility and isolation, making the scene one of the most powerful reflections on our existence. Astronomer Carl Sagan spoke about this dot with deep reverence. Years later, both voyagers breached the heliosphere, the Sun's protective bubble. Voyager 1 entered interstellar space in 2012, followed by Voyager 2 in 2018, marking a new chapter in human space exploration. Even in the emptiness between stars, Voyager 2 continued to listen. Its plasma wave system picked up a faint hum, a quiet but real scene of plasma waves, offering new data about the interstellar medium. Voyager 2, now 14 billion miles from Earth, still communicates, sending precious data from the edge of space, scenes we once only dreamed of. In 1989, it reached Neptune, the final stop in its planetary tour. It became the only spacecraft to visit Neptune, capturing hauntingly beautiful scenes of swirling blue clouds and recording the fastest winds in the solar system, reaching 1,200 miles per hour. It studied Triton, Neptune's largest moon, which displayed nitrogen geysers, a frozen landscape, and hints of a subsurface ocean, a potential habitat for life in an otherwise frozen scene. Voyager 2 also noted Neptune's odd magnetic field, which is tilted and offset from the planet's center, adding another mystery to the cosmic canvas. The spacecraft was only meant to last five years. But over four decades later, it continues its mission, a technological miracle built by minds that dared to imagine scenes no one had ever seen. With power less than a light bulb, it still works. Its engineering team cleverly shuts down non-essential systems, prioritizing vital instruments so Voyager can still capture faint whispers from distant scenes. However, power is running low. The team must now choose which instruments stay active, knowing that each choice shapes the scene of Voyager's final contributions. Still, it also serves as a messenger, a symbol of hope. The golden record it carries contains greetings in 55 languages, sounds of nature, and a heartbeat, portraying the essence of human life to any intelligence that might stumble upon this drifting scene. It's a time capsule that might outlive us all, floating for billions of years, untouched, 
unclaimed, a silent ambassador in the theater of the stars. A message across time and space. Voyager 2 gave us a view of the universe that no other mission has. It showed us that the cosmos is grand, but also revealed the fragile scene of our own planet. It awakened awe and responsibility. Now drifting deeper into the unknown, Voyager 2 reminds us that human curiosity never fades. It pushes beyond the familiar, crossing into scenes no one expected to reach. In that remote expanse, Voyager 2's sensors detected plasma waves, creating an eerie background music of the stars. This was humanity's first constant reading of plasma density between systems. The interstellar medium, once thought empty, turned out to be alive, full of faint energy, a scene unfolding slowly with activity. It forced scientists to rethink what nothingness really is. Communicating from so far means signals take over 18 hours to reach Earth. Every successful transmission is a triumph, a fragile thread across space tying us to this lonely wanderer. Voyager 2's fading power hasn't stopped its impact. The information it brings enriches our understanding of the universe, and its discoveries inform the design of future missions aimed at distant scenes. Inspired by Voyager, scientists now send probes to icy moons and explore exoplanets, hunting for signs of life and trying to uncover the next big scene in the story of our universe. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.